The force exerted over a unit area is known as pressure, and pressure is equal to force divided by unit area. There are two factors that are affect for pressure. They are area and force. When changing factors, we can change the pressure. Results of changing the pressure. Then you can see the examples. Thank you for watching. Have a nice day. Hi everyone. I am Akisa Sundarini from Panel National School. Today we are talk about some physics lessons. Pressure exerted by solid. Our subtopic is units of pressure. Pressure equals Newton per square meter and pressure means perpendicular force divided by surface area. You know, pressure is also known as Pascal. Pressure divided by perpendicular force from surface area. The French mathematician Blaise Pascal is invented the word Pascal. You have a question? Okay, let's simplify it. Weight of a cubic box is 400 Newton. It is kept on a horizontal plane. Pressure exerted by the box on the surface is 200 Pascal. What is the contact area of the pressure of the box? So let's simplify. 400 Newton upon 200 Pascal. And we can get the answer as 2 square meter. It is the surface area. What are the factors affecting for pressure? Yes, you know. To decrease pressure, we should increase the surface area. To increase the pressure, we should decrease the surface area. Roads can be easily damaged by high pressure. To minimize the damages, we used large number of wheels to trucks. And by decreasing the pressure, we can minimize the road damages. By increasing surface area, we can decrease the pressure. When cutting something, we use a sharp knife. In here, sharp knife has small surface area. And you know, by decreasing surface area, we can increase the pressure. We have come in our presentations and uh, stay safe, goodbye and have a nice day. Let's meet again in new presentation.